Hey guys, it's your inner chakras. Welcome back to my channel, guys. This is going to be a collective read. It's always a collective read. Let's start with some wisdom, right? Let's just see what spirit has for us. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. Ground this reading. Ground anybody that is coming through. Protect their energy. Protect my energy spirit as I deliver this message as best I can, guys. What's going on, right? Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. What is, the, what is the wisdom that we need to take away with today? Spirit wants you to breathe. Just take some deep breaths, guys. Maybe spirit needs you to meditate. Spirit needs you to think, process, go through some things. Spirit needs you to breathe a little deeper. Maybe you need to let go of some things, right? Take some deep breaths, guys, and truth be told. Spirit says, speak your truth, let it out the window, speak your truth, stand up for yourself. Little owl, right? He says, speak your truth and then breathe. And once you speak your truth, breathe and let the chips fall where they may, right? So whoever it was you was talking to, some people may not like your truth because a lot of people don't want to hear the truth, especially if you speak their truth too. A lot of people don't like to hear their own truth. Speak your truth anyway, right? So here we are, speak your truth, and then breathe, Spirit says. Let's see if we can get some 1-800 to roll on here, see what's going on. Guys, I'm just going to pull some cards, see what's going on for you, your person around you, your situation. If it resonates, go with it. If it doesn't, leave it. You mean the world to this person. Whoever this person is, maybe somebody, they need to take a deep breath before they tell you this is how they feel about you. But you mean the world to this person, truth be told, right? Maybe this little owl is just going to come and sing it to you one day. They were like, hey. Ooh, but then it says God is not going to bless you with someone else's future. That's not how it works. Spirit. Spirit wants you to breathe, right? So this person, you mean the world to this person. However, this person may have a person because God is stepping in and God is saying, hey, I'm not going to bless you with someone else's future. That's not how it works. Either that or you have a person and this person is trying to come in, right? Holy Spirit, holy angels, right? Because if you have a person, you can't be with somebody else, right? You got to empty that jar. It's all fun and games until it's your turn, guys. Somebody may get hurt. So be careful, guys, because you mean the world to this person. However, God is not going to bless you with someone else's future, which means the person that you think is your person may have a person that you are unaware of. And Spirit said, truth be told, it's all fun and games until it's your turn, until it's your turn to get your heart broken, right? So guys, be careful. Yep, this person has a person. How much longer will you wait on this person? This person has a person, period, amen. There it is. This person has a person. Okay. All right. Mm -hmm. Spirit, do tell. Pull out the little Pandora's box. Let's add to it. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, tell us more. Apparently, God, you need to breathe through this reading. Spirit said that first, right? Just breathe. Because some truth is being told here. So, you do mean the world to somebody, but that somebody has a somebody, right? That's some person. Your person has a person. And God is telling you right now, if you know about this, the person that's trying to come into you, you, it's not going to be a blessing. And this could be for your person. If they know they have a person, they're not going to get their blessings with you because God's not going to let it happen. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, Ancestors, take the top off this box, Pandora's box. All right. This could involve a mature woman between the age of 45 and 55, guys. All right. Blame. Somebody's placing blame, guys. Somebody's placing blame. They're avoiding this. They're pointing the fingers at everyone. 
tendering. Okay, guys, so this person is tendering. So not only does this person have a person, they you mean the world to them, but they are they're also online. They also tender. Wow, this person. Depression, tired, melancholy, feeling empty. Maybe this person is depressed. Maybe they're depressed so much so that they have a person that they're unhappy with. Then they have you who you mean the world to this person. However, they're still on Tinder. So this person could be quite depressed, guys. Quite depressed and just all over the place, right? Because you're doing too much. That's doing a lot. So this person feels mistreated and undervalued. And that's probably why they go to Tinder. Because Tinder is something that's in and out, in and out, in and out. That's a quick, um, that's a quick satisfaction, a quick pat on the back, a quick, no, you didn't, a quick, thank you, thank you, right? But it's really short-lived. Daddy, 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 you know, that's really short-lived. So this person is being mistreated in their current relationship. So they don't want to be where they're currently at. They want to be with you because you mean the world to this person. However, God says this person has a person and you will not be blessed with this person. Spirit say you cannot be blessed with someone else's future. But this person, you mean the world to this person. But they don't know how to speak up. So this person is being mistreated and they place blame and they avoid things. But if this is you, woman, you could be the be between the age of 45 and 55. They said this involves a mature woman, an older woman. Not that the younger ones aren't mature. It's just, you know, 45, 55, whatever. Holy Spirit, holy angels. Guys, let's put some tarot on this and see where we go, right? So wands in reverse. There's no passion. Uh, two of pentacles. Yep, this person is placing blame and juggling. Two of pentacles in the upright. So they juggle their issues. They probably juggle you and this other woman here that you can't see. Yep, this person, they place blame because they're not standing very strong. They're not standing in their strength. The strength card is in reverse. So I guess they feel like they just don't have any power, right? Ace of Cups. In reverse, they took their love back. Maybe they found out that their person is tendering online, right? Or maybe their person found out that they were tendering online. But whoever it is, somebody's cup of love was revoked and taken back. Someone said, give me back my cup of love. Yeah. And they ended it, this three cups in reverse. Somebody snatched their cups back. So the cup snatching sent someone into a depression. They probably sent the person that's coming after you into a depression because they were unhappy being mistreated at home. So instead of speaking up for themselves and placing blame and all that stuff, they just got online and started tendering. And maybe their person took their love back. And now here's the three of cups in reverse, ace of cups in reverse, right? Yep, they put an ending to it. So it could be that the person that's coming towards you got caught tendering or got caught reaching out to you. And they got left in the dust by their person. And that's why it's all fun and games till it's your turn, right? So I think your person got left in the dust. But when, when they was with you, you probably didn't even know that they had a person. But their person left them. Mm -hmm. The person left them. They ended it. They put an ending to that world there. So the person that got caught, I think they got caught cheating with you. And that's why they say God is not going to bless you with someone else's future. They got caught cheating with you. Nine of Cups. You fulfilled them emotionally. It goes back here. You mean the world to this person. They want emotional fulfillment, right? Yep, they want emotional fulfillment with this Queen of Cups here. And he's coming in as the King of Wands. Now, I don't know if he's coming in holding his thing in his hand, but that's a lot of passion there, a lot of wands. Either that or he has a lot of things he wants to tell you. 
he's probably going to tell you everything that I just told you, right? He's going to tell you everything that I just told you. He's going to try to manifest you back in, guys. This is the magician here. This person feels that they have everything that they want, everything that they need, or that they can get whatever they want and whatever they need, right? This person, Ten of Swords. Ten of Swords. And then King of Cups in reverse. Whew, Spirit, you got me. I think your person got caught on Tinder by their person. So now they want to come to you. Hmm. King of Cups in reverse. This person is not offering any love. Spirit, clarify this King of Cups in reverse. Who is this? Who is the King of Cups in reverse? King of Cups in reverse, guys. This is Nine of Wands. Someone who's being persistent. I guess they're going to try to come forward now, right? Yeah, they're going to try to come forward to you after they drop all these burdens. They're just not going to tell you that they have all these burdens. But know this. Spirit halted this because God's just not going to blame you. Yeah, this person wants balance now. They want balance equals give and take. Six of Pentacles. And they've been watching you. So I think this person played themselves. I think they played themselves because they been, they was mistreated and undervalued. So they went to Tinder. And now I just think they get slapped the hell up. It's all fun and games until it's your turn, right? So now this person could be depressed. They're placing blame. They're being avoided. Everything, guys. But they're watching you now. They're trying to come to you, right? They're trying to come to you. They're going to offer you this love here, this page of cups here. They're going to offer you this new love, guys. But remember this. Spirit said they still have a lot of options. Seven of cups. So this person is still coming in playing games, right? This person is still coming in needing to make decisions, which means they still have a lot on their plate, even though it looked like their person walked away from them, right? But they're going to rush their asses into you. They're coming in as the Knight of Wands energy with their dick in their hand, right? There they are. Three of swords, guys. Not only is their dick in their hand, but they're also coming in with a broken heart. So be ready to heal somebody if that's what you want. The tower in their life has fallen. And here you are, queen of wands. They're coming to you. They're coming in slowly as the knight of pentacles, but they're coming in. All right, guys. This is your reading. <laughs> He's going to offer you a knight of cups. Proposal of some kind. Guys, spirit said breathe because this was a reading. Truth be told, right? You mean the world to somebody, but however, this somebody has somebody. And they place blame on everybody just to avoid anything that's going on. I think this person that mean you mean the world to was online tendering and got caught by their person. You probably didn't even know they had a person, but they did. And so it seems like shit's hitting the fan and they want to come back to you because in their past relationship, they could have been depressed, tired, melancholy because they were being mistreated and undervalued. And maybe that's what sent them to Tinder. Neither here nor there. They put you somewhere in the middle. Right? So guys, if this is your reading, this is your reading. If it isn't, do not claim it. But there's some stuff going on here. Right? Yeah, some stuff is going on here. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. Peace.